it's a common thread that runs through all companies, which is training and teaching never ends. So getting that mindset of, you know, you can have training on Canva, you can know a, a certain degree, but if you want to be taught graphics, you have to continue learning constantly. So training is maybe short lived in a subject matter where you become proficient enough. The teaching aspect is becoming a lifelong learner. So we're constantly teaching people in the program about teaching and training and coaching. Uh, you can be the best in the world naturally, but if you don't have structure and guidance coming from a coaching aspect, you can't get to even a greater level. So you have to be open to coaching. You can't come in and say, I know it all. And the last aspect is collaboration. We formed little pods in sales logic. We took a similar approach and kind of gave each little, naturally started to form little groups of people that they liked, like to engage with, work with. And what's happened is they've self-motivated themselves. The eight week coaching group um, has their own WhatsApp and I get on there and give them little plugs of motivation every single day or every other day. And then they themselves are getting on chats. They're holding open houses, you know, working together. Sometimes different personalities have an issue with each other here and there, but I keep reminding them that no one is perfect to work through it, to support one another. So it's really rare that you see collaboration in real estate because everybody's kind of competitive, but I've taken competition off because the only person that you should be competitive with is yourself trying to become a better version of yourself. So I've taken that out of their mentality, whether some level of it exists or not, that's not a company culture that we have. There are some people who want to work real hard. So maybe they can look better than other people, but that's not the culture we teach. And eventually positivity always wins over negativity. I always look at competition as being a negative and collaboration as being a positive. Thank you for watching. If you found this video helpful, please consider liking and subscribing to the channel. You can also connect with me on social media for more content. Your support is greatly appreciated.